This is Alex. Welcome to the video. We're going to talk about how to remove your mugshot from arrest.org. So they're pretty accommodative in their removal policy and it's a pretty long standing website. It's been around uh, ever since this has been um, a thing. So they have a pretty high domain authority and it's pretty, uh, they rank well. So if your image is on here, you're going to want it off. So you click on the state where you're at or you can search your name, whichever you prefer. Uh, then you click on a result. Click on more information. And so for this particular person, we're not going to see uh, the removal link. So it depends on um, how new or old your image is as to whether or not you'll see a link. So for this person, we can't find one. So let's do something a little different here. We'll go and we'll go, let's see if you can go deep here. Page equals four. Let's do page equals. So I'm gonna move this down so you can see me typing in, in the URL bar. So I'm gonna just go page equals and I'm gonna put, I don't know, let's see 95 let's see what happens okay so it doesn't have a page 95 so let's do 55 and see what happens actually yeah we'll do 55 all right so that actually brings up a, a page so let's try a result here more information and we don't get one here either so let's do Let's go back. Let's go. And then also they do have a contact page. So they do have an email address, info at arrest.org if you'd like to email them. But there is a link that you can find. You just have to dig around for it. So here I don't see it either. And my apologies to these people that I am showing. Actually, that's not what I want to do. I want to keep. Let's uh, okay. So we have page. Th let's see how deep we can get into a page. Let's try ninety-three. Nope. Let's try eighty-three. Mm, let's try sixty-three. Okay, so sixty-three brings us a record. Let's click here and see what date this is for this person. So it's still 2022. So it may not give that option. It doesn't give that option. So let's go back again. Let's try 73. I wonder how, so what I'm trying to do is actually figure out how they're the, like the naming order of their actual URL so we can kind of figure out the right SQL query to get an old page alright so it doesn't like that there's a lot of ways you can search so let's just pick, see if one of these is older. That's still 2022. So they don't have the link on any of their new records. So I'm going to figure out an old record and do it. And we'll do it that way. But I was trying to see if there's a way I could search and do it easy. So that way anybody who's watching this video can just search on their own and find an older record. So give me a second here. All right, so I was able to figure it out. So uh, the, what I'm going to do is actually post this link below the video. So you have to do arrest.org forward slash remove forward slash question mark ID equals. And then there is a eight digit number that appears after that, which is basically an ID. 
um, a unique a unique identifier for um, somebody that's listed on this website. So if you have that eight digit number, you can make up a number and possibly use somebody else's um, page if your page or your particular record doesn't generate a removal page because it appears like when we were searching the newer um, individuals don't create a removal page. So you would have to use this naming convention or this URL that I've I've kind of created here and um, find a random person and then submit your request on that random person and hope that it kind of goes through. So you have a couple options here. It says the arrest has been sealed or expunged. The charges were dropped or adjudicated not guilty or not adjudicated guilty other and remove my date of birth and address. And then essentially you have an email address to get an email confirmation and then a file upload in order to upload any documentation that you have to support that request. So if you have some you know, documentation from your, from your lawyer saying that the case was you know, dropped or sealed, expunged, dismissed, whatever, or if you have some document documentation directly from the courthouse, um, that's something I would upload and um, request uh, you know a letter stating that uh, you would like your record to be removed so that is how you would remove a mugshot from arrest.org and if you have any questions feel free to reach out to us our number here is 813-421-8334 and my email address is admin at removemymugshot.org